Welcome back everyone. You may be experiencing some issues with your Snapchat account. For some reason, you just keep getting into this, you know, no connection, can't connect type of error. Now you can fix this a lot of different ways, but one of the most common ways and probably the thing that's affecting it for you is to actually go ahead and check your network connection. Now, as you can see, I have a decent connection. It's definitely not strong, but you want to make sure that you are having a solid connection in order for you to actually utilize Snapchat. So what does this mean? You essentially wanna go, whether you have an Android or iPhone, it doesn't matter. You wanna make your way over to your settings. You wanna check your Wi-Fi connection. Make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi or connect to a cellular connection. If you have a SIM card inserted, you're pretty much set. And then what you wanna do, that is good enough for the most part, but you also wanna see how long it takes for you to go ahead and just load up a web page. So open up your app store and you wanna see how long it takes to load things up. As you can see, that was kind of good. You know, it wasn't extremely fast. If I go into Safari, let's see how long it takes to load up this thing, iPhone, Pasco, whatever. Took a little bit of time. If it takes an extremely long amount of time to load these things up or Safari pages aren't loading or App Store isn't opening up or whatever, then you have a network connection problem. You're going to have to go ahead and either connect to a stronger Wi-Fi, connect to a Wi-Fi in general, connect to a better cell signal, or you're not going to be able to utilize your phone's connection. That is pretty much the, you know, a very basic thing, but some people will overlook this, think it's a more complicated problem. But this by far, in my opinion, is the thing and probably is the main reason why your Snapchat just isn't working and why you're getting a no connection issue. Now, if that doesn't fix it, the next thing I would recommend doing is to go ahead and make sure you have Snapchat updated on your device. So if you're connected to a solid connection, I would recommend going ahead and updating your specific Snapchat account. So in order to do this, you wanna make your way over to your app store, you wanna go and click search and you just wanna search up Snapchat. So you just wanna search up Snapchat like this, click here, and you wanna make sure Snapchat is up to date. Again, if you're on a very outdated version of Snapchat, you're going to run into a lot of different issues. So making sure you're up to date is going to help you out in the long run. And if you're on a super outdated version of Snapchat, that may actually end up being the issue for you. So updating your Snapchat app will probably end up fixing it. Finally, the last basic thing that typically ends up being the issue for your Snapchat account is actually if Snapchat servers are down. So what this looks like, is essentially you go on Snapchat, nothing is working, no connection issue, whatever. Maybe you can't send anything or whatever the case is. This is usually caused or sometimes caused by a server problem on Snapchat's side. So there's really nothing you can do. You just have to basically wait it out until Snapchat fixes it. Typically it's like Snapchat is down. Something like that is trending on Twitter. You can also look in the comment section of this video or videos like these and see if you know other people are talking about it. Most of the time this will end up being the issue and you can pretty much fix it by just waiting it out and letting Snapchat fix the issue. And then randomly your Snapchat account will start working again. It's very random, but those are typically the main ways to go ahead and fix your Snapchat issues if for some reason there's no connection or anything like that. So that's essentially it. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys get hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.